Greetings everyone! While working on a 3D Pixar engine on top of Unity, we wanted to give the world a more curated feel by giving select objects pixel perfect outlines. Typical to the Pixar style, outline highlighting brings more contrast and depth to the objects rendered into the world. Here I'll share my progress with creating this system. To achieve outlines in a 3D world, we need some information to base these on. I ended up going with a typical solution that utilizes depth and normal maps to provide this data to the shaders. In modern versions of Unity that uses a universal render pipeline, we can create a render feature with this line which provides these textures for us to use during rendering. With our depth map drawn, we can see outlines defined by a contrast in the depth value. To create outlines based on this, we need to create a shader that calculates this contrast value. This contrast is calculated in a shader by sampling our depth texture above, below and to the size of our pixel. The width of our outline is defined by the distance of the samples from our pixel and to achieve pixel perfect outlines we sample the depth texture exactly one pixel out in each direction. Last thing to mention is the order we take the difference in our algorithm. This is where we choose if our outlines are found around the object or on the object on its edge. To get the outlines around the object, just change the order to be the difference of the sample minus our chosen pixel's depth. Now that we set our threshold value, we can only see the outlines around objects. To achieve outlines on 3D objects and their edges, we need to utilize the same algorithm on the normal map with a few changes. Normals are three-dimensional and we can only take the difference after converting it to a length value which can be negative. And as such, we need to control the normal with other methods different to the depth texture. To only choose one of the outlines to get pixel perfect ones, we need to choose a direction in which the normals are chosen. With this, we can discard the outlines found that are in the wrong direction and such get the access to only the outlines on one side. The part commented out is for an old solution that did the outline pass for the whole screen, and this makes it only apply on shallow pixels and not outside the objects. If you wish to do this, you can try it out. At the end, we just override with depth outlines and give variable values to each. These can be used to apply a blend to the objects after. I want to thank Cody King for providing a good resource for outline stuff, and I'll link his channel below. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, ask them below and I'll try to answer. And if you are interested in following the progress of this project, like and subscribe. Bye.